So Nigel, one of the hardest parts of getting on the property ladder is that initial deposit. So what is the best way to save for a deposit? The best way would be to, you know, have a job that pays a million pounds a week. Um, <laughs> but I would generally say, obviously, making saving habits a priority, uh, using an ISA that you can't dip into and out to because obviously most people month to month have different things coming up. But if you have a, a set um, account there to be used solely for the deposit of your property, that's going to help you um, build it up over this course of a year to two years. In terms of the deposit itself, how much is a deposit usually? How much would somebody need to get onto the property ladder? So it all depends on the property price. Um, for instance, if you take a 200 grand property, uh, you would usually need at least 10 grand, which would be 5%. Um, usually I would say to most of my clients, that the, the more deposit you put down, the better interest rate you're gonna get from the, from the lender. So if you can put down 10%, great. If you can put down more, even better. That's gonna reduce your monthly payments.